All right. So we're back. This will be uh, 301 through 450. Uh, I actually literally just dropped this in the snow like an idiot. So I figure I kind of just shook it off real quick. And uh, heck, testing its reliability. Might as well shoot it like that, see how it does. So uh, 301 through uh, 450. Here we go. Very last round. Did it again. I was clean. 149 rounds. That very last one. Fell to eject all the way. Um, otherwise, she ran good. Here's the last 50 rounds. Uh, we're going to just burn through these. Pretty much as fast as it'll go. And uh, see how it does. Uh, fell the lock back open, probably right in the slide lock. Oh, 451 through 500. Ran good. Uh, go back to the truck and uh, have some final thoughts. All right, you guys, just finished up shooting. Um, pretty pleased with the way it performed. Had some fail to ejects or fail to extracts. Um, not sure exactly what. Um, something does seem to be kind of off with that extractor. Um, some of my shells are going, you know, right to the right like they should, kind of over the shoulder it looked like. Um, some were landed on my arm. Some were ending up, I don't know, four or five feet in front of where I was shooting. Um, that's not natural and what I think is happening is they're bouncing off the RMR there as you can see. See all those spots on there and flakes? Yeah, that's from the brass hitting the uh, RMR. So not real thrilled about that. Uh, the glass is pretty dirty on it from me dropping it in the snow like an idiot. But uh, otherwise it ran well. Um, I'm going to have to look into that extractor issue. I believe I saw somewhere before that people were having problems with the Gen 3 extractor. Um, so I will have to look into that and see if I can't maybe get a little aftermarket one that's gonna do a better job of getting those shells to where they need to go so it's not beating the crap out of the RMR. Um, otherwise, 
ran well. I'm pleased with it. Um, definitely need to practice more on uh, like drawing and picking up that dot. Um, I, was, I was losing it quite a bit and having trouble picking it up still. So that just comes with practice and uh, just get out and practice with it more and do lots of dry firing and practicing at home. Um, and we'll uh, see how it does. But uh, thanks for watching. Comments, questions, concerns, leave them below. Um, yeah, appreciate you watching, you guys. Thanks so much.